Thank you for joining us. We still want to talk about alarms and, and, and really how to get those alarms out of the system so you can use them for your business practices, such as when you get inspected by a, a regulatory agency. So for instance, again, under reports, alarms, under the breadcrumb, you can select active, history, non-priority, and priority. The one that the regulatory agency is going to look for is history. And what's nice about the 450 plus under the actions button, you can go in and select a range of dates for those particular alarms. So for, for instance, I have mine set for August 31st through September 15th. If an agency wanted some specific range, you'd give it to them and put it in there, select it, hit check mark, and then more importantly, if there's more than one page, you could pull the pages down and scroll down. If you hit the print button at this point, now what's gonna happen is the console will print out the entire report that you selected for a date range.